If the HP Touch Smart screen does not work after upgrading to Windows 8, installing an older touchscreen driver from the Windows Update catalog can correct the problem. This video shows how to install an older touchscreen driver from the Windows Update catalog. From the computer desktop, open Internet Explorer. Type catalog.update dot microsoft dot com into the browser's address bar and then press enter on your keyboard. If prompted, install the Microsoft Update Catalog add-on. Type next window in the search field and then press enter on your keyboard. From the list of search results, find the driver named next window dash input dash next window Voltron touchscreen version 3.1.6.0. Click Add next to the name of the driver. Click View Basket. Click Download. Click Browse. If a user account control message opens, click Yes. And then choose where to save the downloaded file. The download may take a few minutes. When the download is complete, click Close. Open the downloaded folder named Next Window dash Input dash Next Window Voltron Touchscreen. Double click the .cab file to open it. Click the first file and then press Ctrl plus A on your keyboard to select all the files. Right click on any selected file and select Copy. Click the back arrow in the upper left corner of the window to go back to the folder named Next Window dash Input dash Next Window Voltron Touchscreen. Right click inside the blank or white portion of the window and select Paste. All of the files from the .cab file are extracted into this folder. Double click the file named NW Voltron Setup Light Desktop underscore 3.1.6.0.f.exe. If a user account control message opens, click Yes. The driver setup wizard opens. Click Next to start the installation. Read and respond to the Windows to install the driver. After the driver is installed, restart the computer. If the touchscreen still does not work, please refer to another video showing how to disable a graphics card. You can find additional helpful videos at hp.com forward slash support videos and on our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash how to for you.